Hey, what's up, YouTube? Um, this is actually a surprise video because my allergies have been kicking up. You know, you could probably tell from my voice. But I figured, why not try to start up the video? You know, not let these this allergies like affect me. I've been like swerving through school really good. Um, you're probably wondering why I have these on. I don't know if you can see them. Well, they're just, uh, they're spike gloves. They're what I normally use to keep my phone up, like behind it. But um, I'm not emo. But I do think emo people are interesting. I think everybody's interesting because, quite frankly, I like studying people. But in this video, I don't know quite what I'll be doing. I'm trying to see like some active. Well, you know what? I do happen to have a song that I want to play that I that I'm dying to listen to right now. I would envision this song to be at a, a pretty interesting rave. But yeah, today, uh, nothing really interesting happened, but, well, you know what, there was one thing that happened at school, the farmer's market event, you know, all the blacks were buying the watermelons, and the strawberries, like, everybody was just taking those, I was kind of wanting an extra one of those, but it's like, whatever. I did manage to get the, this honeydew melon, and... These three Granny Smith apples, though, loading right now. I really wanted to just go by the table and like cuff everything up. That's pretty much what Miss Brown did. This actually shouldn't take too long. Yeah, this tablet is kind of jank. But yeah, what I have to do is I have to continuously do something like if it's like like just like all all over the place because if I don't then um you know, if I don't keep moving, then I'll, I'll start coughing again. And I cough like maybe every five minutes, which is very annoying. See, I clicked the search button like four times already. Let's see. Yeah, taking it a bit slow on this video. There it goes. Come on. I wonder. Don't die on me. I might actually do a, for my next video, maybe a improvisation because I did that yesterday in school. I mean, it was all right, but 
it usually gets interesting when I get to play a character that I'm not really comfortable with. Here it goes. I'm just, just gonna work. Samurai Jack when those a bunch of those kids were just like doing karate and dancing at the same time. I've actually never seen this before. Gotta get you in that mood. I get the pump pumps you up. I don't know how they can move that fast. I mean, I know it's all fake, but... but I know they probably, like, cut out some parts where they almost fell off the line, where they were, like, flying through the air. Because <clears throat> they have to attach them to, like, strings that, that are attached to a pole that who knows how sturdy. That would just be awesome. Just to glide through the air. Like. Oh, I guess we're. Oh, I'm gonna just stop it right here. Yeah, I just felt like listening to a song right now. I don't really pay attention to the time on my videos. I don't know what the heck that was. Yeah. These, the length of these videos is like so unpredictable. Um, only I can find something that I can like get going on, but I guess I could talk about um, <clears throat> So this episode on uh, drugs, Incorporated, oh, it, was, it was so interesting the other day. They were talking about like how messed up D Detroit was. But then it was interesting because someone who, I mean, they're a drug user, but you know, you can't like automatically denounce drug users because they are humans. Like each and every one of you and me, doesn't really matter. But, um... He was talking about how he thought about leaving Detroit, but he was like, man, it's so real that I, like, I can't possibly step foot out of here. I was like, dang, like, that holds some truth. And I don't know if you could see. Yeah, because somehow I, I look, like, extremely dark when I get closer. And it's like, light. It's like you can see all my facial qualities and whatnot. But I found it interesting how it's it's so easy to lie nowadays because this guy offered one of the I don't want to call her a crackhead because that's kind of a negative term. I want to call her just like a, a friendly drug user. And she looked terrible. I mean, one of her eyes, like, looked like a, a sunny side up egg. Like, you, you're like, what, what is that? But she, someone offered her, like, three bucks. He was like, 
<laughs> it was like the funniest thing. He was like, uh, so you're not going to buy drugs, right? It's like, you're not going to buy no dope. And she was like, yeah, I'm going a, I'm to a get a Sunday with it. <laughs> and I was laughing. I was like, man, she's screwed with you. Because <laughs> I know exactly what she's doing. And then she just got a bottle cap with, you know, some dope. She was like, this would give me um, a little blow. But it's like, whatever. And at the time, I was like, because if I, I don't even know what blow is. I don't even think I want to know. Because I used to think, you know, that blow was just like limited to a sex term. But it, you know, it's like, there's so many terms that mean more than one thing. And off of that, I think I'll be cutting it to a, another video. So, catch you later.